Guys, our first episode's tomorrow. What what are we doing? Oh, Ben, we're planning our first episode. Ben, come on, we're gonna get it done. Ah! Uh, guys, I have this great idea. So I'm gonna dress up as a Spartan, walk through a giant field, and then we're all gonna go to the high school and walk through a tunnel with a bunch of lights and epic fog. Jeremy, that's a terrible idea. Okay. Oh, oh, I have an idea. So we have to let people know that video announcements are going to be every other Friday. So how about we have Jade come up to Jeremy and be like, Hey Jeremy, when are video announcements? And then Jeremy will be like, They're every other Friday, Jade. Thanks for asking. And then Jade's like, Oh cool, I'm never going to ask that question again. And Jeremy says, I love you. Yeah. No. Wait, guys, I think I have an idea. Let's make a skit about us making a skit. Wait, that was actually pretty good. No, yeah, no, that's, that's great. We can use this. We can do it. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Wait, I'm confused. Did we just film it? Good morning, BHS, and welcome back to Spartan News. I'm Jeremy Greer. And I'm wearing a suit. <laughs> you can. <laughs> you thought it was all hype, BHS, but it's not. It was just mostly hype. Wait, that was hype? I think so. Litter has become a rampant problem at our school. It's worse than my bedroom. <laughs> Make sure to put your trash in the appropriately marked bins, either outside the lunchroom or anywhere around campus. And remember, absolutely no eating on the turf fields or in the gym. Please do this BHS, otherwise it would make Jeremy very sad. Wait, is it raining? Urgent weather report. It's raining. Grant, the camera's over here. It's raining! Remember to wear orange on Wednesday of homecoming week for anti-bullying awareness. I know I'll be wearing orange. Urgent weather report. It stopped raining. Guys? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and now to Colin with the field report. What's your name? My name's CJ Waite. And if you were to describe your summer in three words, how would you describe it? Sleep, swimming, and more sleep. All right. So, boys, um, what are three words that will describe your summer? Uh, I mean, geometric lettuce mural. Inner tubing, salt water, jellyfish. Three words. Super califragilistic, expialidociously awesome. Fun, lazy, and exciting. Uh, new Ford Mustang. Nice, nice. How would you describe your summer in three words? Uh, water, caterpillars. Caterpillars. And... Good, clean, fun. Good, clean, fun. Good, clean, fun. That's what I like to hear. GLF. GLF. GCF. That's right. <laughs> what, what are we talking about? Summer. How to describe your summer in three words? Sunny. Sunny. Summary. Summary. I slept in a lot. Cool. That's, that's All right, cool. Word. All right, so I'm here with varsity golf captain. Ryan Zuzowski, senior. Uh, Timmy Taylor. Andy Johnson. All right, so what are you guys' goals and expectations for the upcoming golf season? Well, we want to send six to state overall. We have a good team right now. We want six players. Is there anything cool or crazy that happened to practice so far this season? Um, sometimes kids get rolled down hills. Is there anything that you want to say to the high school to get them supporting golf or coming to matches if they can? Um, 
I don't know, we, we attended a girls' match yesterday and it was pretty close. Absolutely. But, yeah, well, you guys should all come support us. All right. Well, thank you, golf team. So, can you guys introduce yourselves and your sport? I'm Natalie Vukic. I'm Maddie Ketchisai. And we play girls' soccer. Awesome. So, you guys have any goals or expectations for this season? Um, Make it to state. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's pretty early in the season right now, so we're kind of just trying to start our first games off well. And yeah. We'll see where it goes. Um, is there anything you want to say to the high school to get them out to games? We rock. We're definitely just the come best to our games. Ball sport. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right. So, I'm here with boys cross country captains. Thomas. <laughs> Peter. Austin. All right, cool. So what are you guys' expectations or goals for this year cross country? Well, we expect to do a lot of running. We hope to win and go to state. Um, hard work, determination, good attitudes. Good dudes, good moods. Excellence over everything. Very cool. Very cool. All right, and then is there anything crazy that happened to practice that you'd want to say to the school? Any uh, cool stories? Yeah. Uh, no. Other than just running. We had a person fall off a cliff once. That's kind of cool. You got a concussion, got a concussion yeah. It's kind of and cool. Stitches. That's pretty crazy. <laughs> it was really cool. Yeah. I guess, do high schoolers usually come to you guys' meets to watch them? No? Never. Do you go, Do you want to change that? Yeah, Is there anything that you'd want to say to the high school high schoolers to make them come? Our shorts are short and we have pale thighs, so come out and watch us run. <laughs> so I'm here with Girls Cross Country now, so you guys can introduce yourselves. I'm Elizabeth. I'm Ivy. I'm Ziggy. All right, so do you guys have any expectations for the season? We want our team to do really well this season because we have the biggest team ever, and our girls' team has a really good chance of making it to the state meet. All right, cool. Thanks, guys. Thanks for that sports report, Colin. In other sports-related news, make sure to come out to the football game tonight. It's against Eastside Catholic, and I'm sure the boys will do well. I know I'll be there. Oh, look at all the spiders. Thanks for watching. You enjoyed our first episode. And we'll see you with our next episode on Homecoming Week. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's ridiculous. <laughs> all right.